Hello and welcome to Final Fantasy XIV Online. Today we are continuing our uh, character we've been playing. Let's see, uh, Yurdi Tanky, I believe, a paladin. We are currently level 45. And yeah, so last episode we got to this quest right here to do this dungeon. And I just didn't have it in me to go through that dungeon anymore. So I... Uh, we're going to start there. Uh, we're going to have to use the uh, duty finder and enter stone vigil. So let's go ahead and do that. And let's see here. He's forgetting how to use this thing. Stone vigil right there. Let's go ahead and join. There we go. So it's uh, what, three days before Christmas, December 22nd. And uh, yeah, hopefully everybody is uh, doing all right. It looks like we are waiting on, uh, it's gonna be, a, gonna be a five minute wait probably, geez. Uh, so let's go ahead and, uh, pull. I've been killing this dragonfly for the last, uh, few minutes, just practicing some, uh, rotations and stuff. Just to see, uh, I, I literally only play this game on, uh, on Tuesdays, so I, I get a little rusty on it. I've been uh, spent most of today working on my uh, EverQuest Live characters, trying to uh, get their uh, multi-box macros all set up nice and uh, useful. <laughs> I uh, removed the cleric from the group and replaced the cleric with an enchanter, and uh, I actually replaced the shaman with a different shaman that I had on the same uh, same account. Mostly uh, after doing the research and people telling me that the race does not matter anymore, I wanted to have an Ixar uh, shaman instead. So I uh, I had already had one from my I think I made the character back in 2007. So uh, when I consolidated all my accounts to one uh, server. It made uh, made more sense just to use that one. He already has his epic, so it's a little bit uh, he's a little bit higher higher level, but they're all uh, they're all 60 and under at the moment. I'm just trying to work out all the rotations and the uh, the IS boxer macros to get everything uh, everything working fluid <laughs> before I uh, start streaming that again. Just because there's so so much going on now, I have uh, I took out the wizard and replaced the wizard with my druid. Uh, I I because I tried originally the uh, the the uh, what's it the shaman healing alone with a uh, DPS class. I think it was a mage, and that was before I switched to the higher level shaman and. He couldn't keep up with healing my Shadow Knight at, uh, I think they were all about 51 at the time. I think they're 52 now. And he couldn't keep up, so I was like, okay, I'll bring the Druid in and have that, you know, if I need a backup heal. And Druids seem to have everything a wizard does except a little bit less damage and a lot more utility. So I thought that was going to be, uh a good swap over so it's uh i'm now have uh what is it shadow knight shaman uh bard uh what's the other class druid enchanter and mage so i had to do a lot of <laughs> re-leveling of characters offline and just move them around and make them uh Make the group, the characters on the accounts make sense. Since you can't move characters from accounts to other accounts. For some reason. Ah, uh, let's see here. Make sure that's working. Alright. Pretty long queue time. I guess it would be faster if I did random. But, uh... 
I don't want to level up uh, normal <laughs> too fast so that I'm like still I'm almost caught up with the main main quest and so if I if I keep doing the random dungeons and stuff I'll I'll get too much bonus experience. Uh, so keep doing that. Hopefully we'll get a group soon. Unless there's some <laughs> I'll feel real dumb if there's some kind of uh, bonus uh, you queue up, it gives you the quest dungeon you need. <laughs> that would feel dumb. Uh, let's see here. But I mean it should automatically do that just by queuing for uh, what I'm looking for. Okay. I think I got the rotation down. I got the. I make sure I do iron will, which is the threat, threat uh, increasing uh, skill. I put all my defensives on this third bar, so I can just put those, click those as I need to. I don't know how do I get rid of this play guy. There we go. Nope. There we go. Perfect. What is all this? Withdraw all free stands. Let's get him back out. This little thing is uh, pretty, uh, pretty neat. It <laughs> keeps me healed uh, quite a bit. All right, let's get this one that's gonna attack us. It's our Captain America shield. I like that. Oh, there we go. Duty is ready. Let's go ahead and join. Light party. Here we go. So I didn't look up the dungeon beforehand, like I, I planned on doing, but uh, we'll see. I, I I think I remember it from uh, back when the game first came out. The Stone Vigil. Yeah, I think, I think it's a, a fairly straightforward dungeon. All right, let's go. Clicks it off automatically. I hate that. I think I got everything. It's hard to tell. Seem to work out pretty well. All right, we can go this this way, I guess. There's a torch lit over this way, so yeah, there's some guys over here. All right, I guess I can't attack him. Reducer. I, was, I wish there was some kind of icon I could see that shows if I have aggro or not. That would be uh, most beneficial. Dodge that. I wonder if these letters above their name mean I can target them. Nope. I was thinking that if I hit the letter, it would target them, but that is just weird. Alright, let's 
pop reprisal again. Let's walk out of this one. idea where I'm going, so. Looks like that was the boss's room? There's a pinpoint in there. Let's see. Make sure they know it's my first time. DPS got some really cool uh, effects going on. All right, there's nothing in there. All right, this way. All right, there's the first boss. considering this to be my last twitch stream it seems to be uh <laughs> quite the uh, interesting uh platform these days and i just don't feel like uh with like the current legislation for uh copyrighted music and stuff that twitch is going to be the uh best place to continue even though I go way out of my way to make sure I don't do any uh, any kind of copyrighted music or anything. So that seems to be, I don't know, I think just doing it all on YouTube might be easier. The, the management tools seemed, uh, for scheduling stuff, seemed a lot better on uh, YouTube anyway. Like I can put a thumbnail and I can schedule it ahead of time like like I the, the actual stream itself schedule it versus the uh, like right on twitch it's just I'm setting that on this day I'm gonna do this kind of thing so that would be interesting I'm thinking I already feel like this is going to be my last stream for 2020. Because I, I need to get some things done. I'm going to probably move my office to the other side of the house. And uh, get all that done over the, uh, over the holiday. So I'm uh, strongly considering that. Alright, what do we get here? Uh, greed. Okay, so let's see, uh, this way maybe? This looks fun. Of course, it's a dead end. Why is this guy not coming on me? Oh, there's a treasure chest. Okay. Greed. Oh, 
right? So that's my current plans for that. Um, still up in the air, but I'm just not going to be able to stream on Saturday. And then I've also decided to move the, uh, the Necro, uh, the EverQuest Necro solo self-bound to a live server. Uh, I'm probably going to continue the Shaman one until he gets to 60. And he's just, it's, he's going to be discontinued there <laughs> because he won't be able to do anything because there's no way for him to get the Torpor spell within the current era that the server's in. And I haven't, uh, I haven't had a chance to continue trying to do raid progression to unlock more, uh, Lucklin and, uh, whatnot. I'm still in Bellos, and I just haven't had a chance to make those, all those videos for that. Nothing in there. So... I'm thinking instead of, because I have so many shamans on live already, I think I have three that are almost 60. I'm going to do a beast lord solo self-bound on a live server if I, uh, if I get the chance. I've never played a beast lord, but they're a lot like a shaman from what I can tell. And they eventually get feigned up, so I guess they're like a monk too. Which is really cool. So we'll uh, we'll see where that goes, but I'm gonna I'll try to finish them up. But I, I figured the necro I want to actually try to join a guild with one eventually. So I'd like to level it up to 115 and then let him do whatever he wants. And I'm gonna do uh, allow him a mercenary, and since race doesn't matter, I don't have to be a scar. So that's kind of cool. So we'll get a little uh, variety. I don't know what I, I don't know what I want to do, race-wise. Maybe a gnome or something fun. I have to look and see what the live uh, classes that can be necromancer are. I know. Uh, I know they added frog locks and stuff like that. So I've never. Uh, I've never uh, played a frog lock, I don't believe, so I think that'll be kind of fun. Uh, sorry, it's getting out. Complicated here. Let's try reprisal. Let's see if I can get out of that. Ooh. Wrong place to stand. Come on. Perfect. There's a chest right here we can click on. What is this? A vigil hat? Greed. All right, got some more in here. But uh, I'm gonna keep up the uh, Final Fantasy series for sure. Uh, looks like yesterday the Cyberpunk uh, 2077 1.5 patch came out, so I'm gonna actually start my playthrough now on uh, on that. I'm off till like mid-January, so, or early January, I guess. So I'm going to have uh, plenty of time to get all this stuff organized and set up. Ooh, we got level 46, I believe. I think that's what level we got. All right, we got another boss. Let's get him. Is everybody in? Yes. Ooh, he's a he's a strong boy. Let's 
get him uh, get him locked in. Yeah, so far it's pretty hard dress. It's uh, I I feel like the healer's healing me a lot. I don't like I've been soloing everything so far, so I don't know if like there's some kind of defensive ability that I need to be using more often than these uh, these ones here, like a rotational one. It's a shield mob. How are you doing there, uh, Drass? Having a good week? Uh, I took uh, some time off from work. Yeah, the end of the <laughs> end of the year is always rough. Uh, ooh, two chests from this guy. Okay, cool. Uh, greed, greed. Okay. Oh, these guys are free now. Okay, shield -tron. Okay, let me try that. I don't think I've used it yet. <laughs> Wasn't sure what I was supposed to do with that. block all attacks. Oh, wow. Okay. I did have it hot barred, so I just wasn't sure uh, if it was a use it all the time kind of thing or not. Sentinel. They do seem to re refresh pretty fast. Okay, those are stunnable. Huh? Okay. Let's get these. How many ever are in here? Three. Alright, this is working out pretty well. Thanks for telling me about that. Chest. Uh, greed. Get that going. Okay. What uh? What DPS do you play? Sucks dying 
a lot faster now. It's crazy. All right. Bard. Okay. Machinist. Oh, monk. Okay. My my first character that I made a long time ago was a uh, bard. And uh, I <laughs> I played with a friend who was playing a, a tank, and I never really learned how to play the class. <laughs> so I got to 50, and then I think something happened with the game or something, and it like got restarted. But uh, when I decided to come back, I uh, went with a whole new one, whole new character. Okay, we got a cutscene. Oh, there's his ship. I paid off. Oh, it's oh, we got a big boy. Let's just do this. All right. Oh, I messed up my view. All right. Oh, that guy was watching the video too. Okay. All right. I guess I could have finished it. <laughs> I need to get more of these healing potions. Hmm. Maki. Makai. Bard. Lighter than air. Oh, maybe that's their guild name. Yeah, that's the guild name. <laughs> I don't know what the little symbols above their name mean, no. Is there any buffs did I get? Is there like an ability character? Oh, good, he's ready. Alright. Let's go ahead and uh, pull. All right, let's shield the Tron that. He is a uh, big boss. kind of things. Okay, flower means returning player. That's pretty cool. Sentinel on this guy. All right. I'm guessing he's going to take off again here in a minute. Not sure what indicates that when he's gonna take off though. Oh, there he goes. Alright, dodge those. Alright, 
Let's go burn that side of the room. Guessing that side of the room next. <laughs> Jeez. Alright, got him. Provoke. Shield the Tron. Let's drop a rampart. Oh, I didn't need to. And then Is this interrupt? Okay. Is there a casting bar? Oh, he does have a casting bar. Can't interrupt him though. Let's go into long arm of the wall. I think that's what it's called. No, fight or flight. Long arm of the arm. Long arm of the law. I don't know what game that is. Ah, uh, which game? There we go. Perfect. Duty complete. Well, hold on. Was that guy do like a giant cat man? What? All right, let's give a player commendation to this guy. Creed. Creed. I don't care. Creed. Oh, I already possessed pass. All right, perfect. When the casting bar is glowing, pulsing, that means you can interrupt it. Okay. I think I need to... Is there, is there UI mods for this game? So I'd like to make it so that it's a little bit easier to see uh, some of those things. Oh, ooh, another one of those crystal things. Oh, the camera froze. <laughs> Jeez. Let's see here, the properties. Okay, I'm just gonna turn the camera off. Okay, you can move and resize them to a point. Yeah, this stupid cam link thing is the most unreliable uh, method of capturing video that I've ever used. 12 be praised. All right, Sid is working on the Enterprise. All right. Yes, that would be a pleasant ride. Ah, spacebar, I didn't disable it. <laughs> uh, there we go. Let's go to Gridania. There we go. Directional buttons. Okay, there we go. I can go through these now. Got a pretty nice ship, this guy. This looks this is all so familiar. I know this airship if I could just Bah, it is no use. Let's go. It's got like a it's got like a saw on the back of it. That's pretty crazy. All right. Okay. Let me uh, fix my camera real quick. I 
and then properties deactivate video activate video there we go perfect camera left <laughs> 